Well hi guys and welcome back to the channel. This is the Crafty Cockney bringing you more doorways. Now where we left off last time, um, we were just finding implements to fix the torture devices uh, that are scattered around this fucking dungeon. I'm not sure why you'd want to fucking repair them, but repairing them we are. And for every one that we repair, we're being rewarded with actually watching people get tortured. You know, this really is a game for all the family. <laughs> the, oh, we've been down here. It was this bloody room we watched. Oh. There was a naked chick here, and she was getting tortured. Tortured. Hmm. looking for implements. What have we got at the moment? We've got this screw thing and that's it. So we're missing some shit along the way. What is that? Part of me doesn't want to know, part of me does. Part of me's intrigued. <laughs> Just really got to check everywhere. Some things may look quite obscure. I mean, that just that looked like a boulder or a rock to me sat in the corner. But it turned out to be a device. You got to really look at everything. I remember this being slanted like this. It's like a broken handle or something here. Is that like a broken knife? That didn't work on it, I don't believe. No. It's just wood. It doesn't look like this would fit anywhere here, but we'll check anyway. Okay. No potatoes. No potatoes for you. Okay, let's head back this way. I'm guessing that, um. Repairing all these torture devices will open another doorway for us. Let's just see if this works. It's like the top of someone's skull. And you're well and truly lost. As we all know, Crafty has no sense of direction. <laughs> Let's try this on this, what looks like a head squishing machine. Oh my god! This geezer! I'm looking forward to bringing him to justice. I hope it, I just, I'm hoping it's not us. We're not the torturer. We've just forgotten about it. That was wrong, mate. That was wrong. Really got to look everywhere. I've already been in here. And missed this. <laughs> this is why we retrace our steps. So we have the third block of wood, so that should work in the um, the leggy thing. Now this bloody thing. I've got to find a, a handle for this. I can't see anything obscure on the floor. Is there something I'm missing? We did get something out of here. Oh look, fuck me in the arse. Um, oh. You son of a bitch. Maybe we did that because we got all the pieces now? A cycle path, I nearly said. <laughs> a cycle path. Ride safely, children. Always use the cycle path. What 
the fuck? Okay, we have a third block of wood. It, get, it gets worse. This dude's not fucking right, mate. I'm sure we have to. I don't want to know what that's for. Gateways are still closed. Closed. I swear this game is trolling me. We've got to fix this still. The only thing I've got left is this. And it won't go on. Buggery, buggery bollocks. Looks like the exit will be taken later on. I think all these shelves under the table. No, there isn't. I'm missing something. I've missed something. I've been in every room. It won't let me pick this stuff up. Damn it! I think that's our last torture. We can't. Was it really our last torture device? Because we've still got a piece of said puzzle. Anything around this corner? That was gross, man. I believe this particular gentleman was never hugged as a child. <laughs> what the fuck? Come on. I bloody hate psychopaths. I do. I've missed something, faux show. Okay, these notes are up on the wall all the time. <laughs> yeah, I need another handle part. The others we've done. Three blocks of word. The head squisher. I would have made my life easier if I just fucking... Oh! Oh, hello! So that's that was really good. So this one here is like a neck squisher. I'm not sure I want to look at this. Okay. <laughs> Let's do it. pick this up. It's not through want of trying. You bloody bloody bastard you can I use can I use the torch? As a rudimentary handle you can Disgusted by what I saw, but quite pleased with myself for working that out. Okay. Just unlocked an achievement there. Chapter one cleared. I wish I could forget about all those horrible places. I'd rather have them as my own memories and not this mix of feelings. My mental privacy has been compromised, and at the same time, I feel guilty as someone who regrets having stolen something precious from its rightful owner. Which was the fate of the Professor? 
What kind of punishment would make him pay for the suffering and the deaths of his countless victims? Yeah, some of that was pretty gross, man. Chapter 2, the Auditorium. Okay. I won't end it just yet, we're only about 11 minutes in. Felix Lundberg, Gothenburg, Sweden, 1954. Artist, sculptor. Connected to diverse missing persons by witnesses and relatives. Doorway's investigations detected that he was one of the last persons to interact with the victims. The case has been kept under wraps, given his social status. He is a renowned sculptor and a consultant for the Royal Swedish Academy of Fine Arts, the place where several missing people were last seen. Right, okay, well, it looks like we're not tracking that professor anymore. <laughs> Looks like we are um, starting a complete new chapter. Oh, I've got a. Oh, no, wrong, wrong button. We've got a sculpture, looks like then. So that'll probably have something to do with this. So, what I'll do is I probably will call it there, guys. Um, and we can start a fresh chapter um, in the next episode. I do hope you enjoyed watching people be tortured again. If you did, remember to hit that old like button. And remember to follow me on Facebook and Twitter too, guys. The links for both are in the description of this video. And I will catch you beautiful bastards for the next disturbing episode. This has been The Crafty Company. And laters!